my last video, I was on the other side of the kitchen. But we're not going to go on that side of the kitchen because it's a mess. I wouldn't recommend doing that if you're a child watching this. Remember when I said what could go wrong? Well, there it went. Can't do that. Screwed that up. We're doing it again. We're dehydrating. We're going to dehydrate again. What are we going to do? We're going to do... We are going to make s'mores. Let's make s'mores with our dehydrator. Let's try it. Let's see if it works. I mean, what can, what can go wrong? What can absolutely go wrong? We can do this. We can do this. S'mores. S'mores. I mean, who needs a fire? Who needs a fire when you have a dehydrator, right? Right. This is going to be so easy. It better be easy. Nothing's going wrong. Everything's going to be great. The trays are clean. I didn't overfill the sink. Let's move these out of the way. Don't need these. Don't need these. We'll put those in the sink right there. I'm on the other side of my kitchen. Have you noticed? My last video, I was on the other side of the kitchen. But we're not going to go on that side of the kitchen because it's a mess. You don't need to see that. I'm not going to make a ton of these. I'm going to make what I'm going to eat. So that might be like seven or eight of them. And my husband is home now, so maybe I'll give him one. Poor guy. You ask him anytime. If we have like stuff in the house that Michelle likes, like, hold on, I'll show you. I like these. I li these. I like these. So I, I tend to eat all of them and he doesn't get any. I mean like all of them. I'll eat all of those. And these. Those. He don't get any of these. I'll have to tell you about the bag of potato chips I left him one day. He actually like filmed some of it so you might see it. But it's funny. It's, it's, it's funny. Alright I'll show you. I went to go get some chips out of the bag and my wife had some earlier I will show you what was left. This is the chip bag. Notice how big the bag is. Now let me come in where you can see the light so you guys can really see and get the full effect in here. Okay, now look, 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 look. There's six little crumbs <laughs> in the bottom of this bag. She's saving it for me. What do you think of that? I still have the bag. I'm like a little kid. But I knew there was a few crumbs in here. And I knew that if I would wake up in the middle of the night and want potato chips, I would have crumbs. <laughs> Let's start this. So, we've got the marshmallows. We're doing the marshmallow thing again. And I've got my scissors. And I'm going to do... I'm going to do better. I'm going to do better cutting the bag open this time. Because last time I had a little spill. So we're going to try not to have a spill. And I'm going to dump a few here. Right through the hole that one went. Well, why not? My dog might want a few. So we're going to lay these. These are whole, whole. Maybe I should move you down. So there we got these dumped on here. They're dumped on here. See? And I'm going to... Gonna break my trays. Hold on. Golly, well, okay. Here I am. I'm gonna leave these whole like this, and um, see what happens with these. My hope, my hope is that they're gonna poof up. Like when you put them in the fire, they probably won't be brown. They'll still be white. I like my marshmallows burnt. I don't know about you guys, but I like my marshmallows so they're like on on fire. So when I was a little kid, okay, maybe now when we have a fire, I like to catch my marshmallow on fire on a stick and like throw it like it's a torpedo. I wouldn't, I wouldn't recommend doing that if you're a child watching this. I did that. The fun things that we did when we were in our 50s. <laughs> so I'm going to try to fish this marshmallow out of here, which will be easier because I don't have all these trays. Because just like the other one, it went it went in the center hole. Right here. I'm going to have to figure, I'm going to get something to cover that hole. So I don't have to be digging all the time. Alright, so that's all I'm going to do. Oh no, I'm going to add some more trays because you're supposed to do that. Hold on. Alright, for better, oh look. Oh, 
when you put the trays on top of the marshmallows, they touch the other trays. That's probably not good. So hold on a minute. Let's put this on top. Those, those might have to ride on the top, maybe. Oh, wait. Oh, they're touching there. We might have to cut the marshmallows in half. Yeah, we, oh, darn it. All right, hold on a minute. We got to cut these things in half. Get yourself some kitchen scissors and then just, we'll just cut them in half. Remember when I said what could go wrong? Well, there it went. You can't leave the marshmallow whole, I guess, because it touches. So cut it in half. Yeah, it's real simple. Just watch. Boom. They just cut right in half. This is much better than using a knife. Can you imagine using a knife? They would be sticking. <sighs> All right, so we had one little, oh, that one still might touch. Darn it, one, maybe two little problems. You know, these scissors were pretty cool. I bet these would have been, I don't know. Don't get off my finger. Okay, let's hope that the lid closes. Now, I don't want to get crappy marshmallow on the top of my lid if it doesn't. All right, we're going to move it down a row. I'm going to move it down a row to see if it fits. I'm so excited about leaving them whole. Can't do that. Screw that up. Oh, look. All right, it works. They don't touch. I'm not going to put these on the top because I don't. I don't want them. I don't want them touching the bottom of this if they poof up. I. I don't want that. Like, if if I have to rotate them, which I probably don't. Maybe I don't know. I'll rotate them lower, not higher. Now the dehydrator setting. We are going to do, what are we going to do? We're going to do 160. You see it there? 160, which is the fish setting, also the marshmallow setting. So we're going to try that and see how this goes. I hope these are good because this would be a fun thing to do with the kids, you know, whenever I'm allowed to see my grandkids again. All right, I have to plug this in behind you. Okay, we got, ooh, got that. It's already running. We'll let this run for an hour and then we'll check back. If I remember, I'll set the timer because I got so I got all the things happening today. All the things. And I don't know, my dryer's done in the back. But all the things are happening today, so I should set a timer. Alright, we're back. I'm back with my marshmallows. And guess what? I have visitors. I have virtual visitors. We have guests. We have guests on our marshmallow show. Yay! Okay, looky there. Can you see them? There's my grandkids. They're here for a virtual visit. They want to watch me. They want to watch me test my marshmallows, and they're bored. They're really bored. So let's en let's entertain the grandkids. All right, you ready? You ready for this? All right, I'm going to turn my dehydrator off. They're going to finish watching me film over here. We're going to set them. Where can we set you guys? We'll just back up a little bit so you could be in the shop. Oh, nope. All right, hold on. I'll figure this out. We're having technical difficulties right now, but, but we'll figure it out, okay? We always figure it out. Okay, there they are. Welcome. Welcome to my cooking, my cooking show. I made s'mores. I made s'mores, and it's too bad they can't be here because what kid doesn't love a s'more, right? Yeah. So, all right, I'm gonna take this apart and check on this, and we're gonna hope that the the grandkids don't fall over. We don't want grandkids falling, right? Okay, here goes. You you don't like? Why don't you like s'mores? Oh, he doesn't. My grandson doesn't like chocolate. I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know. I just know. I can't. I do have another granddaughter. Is she in that house? So where would she be? Downstairs? No, look at this. The marshmallow or the graham crackers are already all broken up in my thing. See? Okay. All right. So we've got graham crackers. I'll set those right here. Now look at these marshmallows. They're already, they're, they're, they're just perfect. It's been an hour. So let me get my chocolate. All right. Got the chocolate. 
You know, G-Paw's here, baby. G-Paw wants one, too. You think? We could talk G-Paw into trying one of these. All right. We have lots of visitors today. There he is. Hi. <laughs> okay, look at these. This is going to work. This is working. This is going to work. Now, I cut him in half, so, and his is kind of bigger, so we'll give him more marshmallows. Watch, let's wa wait for the ooze. Look at that, look at that, it worked. Look at what we got, can you see? All right, one for G-Paw. I wish I could try I know, but I wish you could too. But look at, wait for the gush. Look at there, we made s'mores. It took, it took like an hour, maybe a little even less than an hour, and we made s'mores. Poor grandkids can't come have this. I feel bad eating this in front of you. It's fine. It's fine. All right, let's see. Mm, okay. 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 Um, mm. Mm. It's working. It's working. <laughs> it's working. It's working. g -Pop, what do you think? I'm sitting down here. Oh, he's sitting down. The man's in the frame. Okay. What do you think? Good. The chocolate is melting. This is a success. What, Lukey? Can you, can you drop some? Can you drop some off? Uh, can I drop some off at your house? Yeah. You don't even like these. I want, I want Aww, the next time you guys come over, we will make these, okay? I'll save stuff in my refrigerator for you, okay? So you can have some too. What, yeah? He calls it a marshmallow. Oh, he likes graham crackers and marshmallows and calls it a marshmallow. We think A marshmallow. That's good. All right, G. Paul likes his back there too. Fell on the floor. I'm getting it. I got Listen it. to him. All right. Fell on the floor. We're just having too much fun over here. All right. They want to tell you goodbye. Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching.